guys. Just wanted to do another little um, check-in video with you guys. Um, so yesterday, uh, something kind of interesting happened. Um, I was talking last week with my, my dad about like uh, um, we kind of have an electric vehicle that is uh, has a really little range, but we're minimalist. It's a small little smart car, and um, uh, the range is only 60 miles, so it kind of keeps us, you know, confined in, and we're not really able to go um, see family in Orlando or to like easily be able to go to the beaches. We have to like really, really plan it and find a charging station. And many people um, are struggling with way bigger issues. It's not a big issue um, by any means, but. I'm starting to get more um, like inspections work uh, coming up with my business and that is starting to make it an issue where like I have to rent a vehicle um, for some of these jobs and it eats into my bottom line so I was just kind of like mentioning all that to my dad and um, in passing and just talking with him about it and um, just you know how it kind of you know thinking about different cars and thinking about different options that was last week and yesterday, uh, dad called me and my stepmom and they were on the phone. They're like, hey, we want to talk about something happy with you. And I was like, okay, cool. I thought they were going to talk about like, I don't know, a show they saw or something. And uh, they were like, hey, we want to help you with a down payment for a vehicle. And that just, I don't know, it just really shocked me. Um, it shocked me and it moved me. And, um, into like an overwhelming state of gratitude and um, because my parents don't have a lot of money um, and it's not something they typically do. I've, I've never had this kind of offer made. To, so just for like backstory, my parents um, typically kind of like have been a little standoffish. Um, I mean, they've tried to help what they can, but like for our wedding, we had to pay for that. and. Um, you know, my parents weren't really able to help with like a down payment for our house and that's fine. I'm not like blaming them. I just kind of like setting the bar of expectations. So, um, yeah, so I just was really, um, touched by that. I was shocked by it and surprised and, um, I don't know what's going to happen. I, um, kind of thought about like, part of me was like, no, you don't really, you know, you should do it on your own. But then I thought about how like Dr. Dispenza says, when you're asking for abundance, he says it comes in the form of opportunities. And I thought about that and I was like, this is an opportunity, you know? And also, if you're a person that's living in a state of gratitude, um, it's important to give and to receive. And I think um, this is something that clearly meant a lot to my dad and he is able to help do it. And it's something that makes him feel good. And it's something that puts me in a state of gratitude toward him for being benevolent toward me and being a benefactor in this case. I kind of thought, yeah, why not? Let's do it. Um, so anyway, I applied for a vehicle loan and I'm just kind of waiting right now to see if it gets approved because y'all know my credit, it's not good. Um, and I'm self-employed, so sometimes that can be like ding you because you don't have that steady W-2 paycheck. So um, another thing I'm battling with and practicing, you know, trusting the unknown, practicing the uh, believing in the quantum and this sort of new model is I'm just letting it be. Um, old me would be like calling the bank right now. I want to know what's the answer. Like, hey, did I get approved? What can I do to get approved? Like, you know, I'd be trying to like very like take control and hands on. And another thing I'm learning from Dr. Dispenza is that, that you know, a lot of the life that you're creating is hands off. It's uh, allowing like the divine to take over and take control. So he always says, you just worry about the what and let the divine worry about the how. So like, anyway, I am not calling the bank. I'm being patient. And if it doesn't get approved through this bank, fine, I'll try somewhere else. I'm just gonna like let the quantum take care of, of the, the how it happens. And I think this is a pretty exciting little exercise of abundance and, and um, I'll be interested to update you guys with how it works out.